Hey everyone, and welcome back to the channel. Today we're tackling a common problem the dreaded P0300 code. This code indicates a random or multiple cylinder misfire, which can cause rough idling, reduced power, and even worse gas mileage. Don't worry though, in this video, we'll walk you through some simple steps to diagnose and potentially fix the P0300 code yourself. What is a P0300 code? Before we dive in, let's understand what this code means. A misfire happens when one or more cylinders in your engine aren't burning fuel properly. The P0300 code specifically refers to random misfires, meaning it's not isolated to a single cylinder. This can be caused by a few different things, which we'll explore next. Possible causes of P0300 code. Spark plugs, these are the most common culprits. Worn out spark plugs can't deliver a good spark, leading to misfires. Ignition coils, the coils send electricity to the spark plugs. Faulty coils can disrupt the spark and cause misfires. Vacuum leaks, air leaks into the engine can mess up the air-fuel mixture, causing misfires. Fuel injector issues, clogged or dirty fuel injectors can prevent proper fuel delivery, leading to misfires. Diagnosing the problem. While we can't give specific instructions for every car, here's a general approach. 1. Check engine light. If you have a check engine light on, get the code scanned. This will confirm the P0300 code and might provide additional information. 2. Visual inspection. Look for any obvious issues like damaged spark plug wires or disconnected hoses. Now let's fix the problem. If you're comfortable working on your car, here are a couple of things you can try. Spark plugs, this is the easiest fix. Check your owner's manual for the recommended spark plug type and gap. Replace the spark plugs if they're worn or damaged. Ignition coils, if the spark plugs look good, the next suspect is the ignition coils. Some coils are easy to access, but others might require more work. Check your manual for specific removal and replacement instructions. If the DIY fixes don't solve the problem, or if you're uncomfortable working on your car, it's time to call a mechanic. They have the tools and expertise to diagnose the issue and get your car running smoothly again. By following these steps, you should be able to diagnose and potentially fix the P0300 code yourself. Remember, if you're not comfortable or unsure about anything, leave it to the professionals. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe for more car care tips.